The humanities section of the reading test is worth 25% of your reading score. You'll be asked 10 questions in this category, and they're based on passages from memoirs and personal essays, and in the content areas of architecture, art, dance, ethics, film, language, literary criticism, music, philosophy, radio, television, and theater. The selection may be in first person and usually has a slant or bias. That's the first thing you should look for when reading this selection. It's similar in composition to the social science section, but with more of a concentration on artistic content. You don't have to be familiar with the content of the essay before the test, but instead recognize the author's points of views and the importance of the topic discussed in the essay. The most likely questions will be about the general content, recognizing arguments and inferring points of view that are consistent with the author's perspective. Like other selections, the essay will be between 750 and 1,000 words in length. It's a good idea to start the reading test by looking at the essay you most easily can read or understand. If you have an interest in the arts and philosophy, this may be the easiest for you. Finally, the best way to prepare for the humanities section of the reading test is to take the time to read essays. Look at publications like the Wall Street Journal and read the art section. When looking at the articles, time yourself and practice noting the main ideas and perspectives illustrated in the articles. There's not a topic to study that will help you on the reading test, but you can be prepared by reading often and honing your skills.